morning y'all and welcome to vlogmas day 14. um i want to start off the morning with the reason for the season bible verse it is luke 1 57 through 66 a continuation as we've been discussing the title is the birth of john the baptist <clears throat> When it was time for Elizabeth to have her baby, she gave birth to a son. Her neighbors and relatives heard that the Lord had shown her great mercy, and they shared her joy. On the eighth day, they came to circumcise the child, and they were going to name him after his father, Zechariah. But his mother spoke up and said, No, he has to be called John. They said to her, There was no one among your relatives who has had that name. Then they made signs to his father to find out what he would like to name the child. He asked for a writing tablet, and to everyone's astonishment, he wrote, His name is John. Immediately, his mouth was opened and his tongue set free, and he began to speak, praising God. All the neighbors were filled with awe, and throughout the hill country of Judea, people were talking about all of these things. Everyone who heard this wondered about it, asking, What then is this child going to be? For the Lord's hand was with him. Amen. All right, y'all. Um... This is this is just gonna be real sh short clip of Vlogmas Day 14. I got a call this morning from my sister that my father, who lives in Atlanta, um, had a stroke last night. So I'm on the way. I'm at the airport at LaGuardia, about to hop on a flight and go to Atlanta to check on my daddy. So yeah, I won't be vlogging for the rest of the day because I'm just I'm way too emotional. Like I'm shaky and my heart is beating fast. I've talked to him. He's okay. He's talking. He's awake. But that's my daddy so thank you for watching vlogmas day 14 thank you for watching vlogmas day 14 make sure you subscribe like and share hi, hi guys so i know i said i ended the vlog earlier but just wanted to give y'all a little update i'm in atlanta walking back into the hospital where my daddy is and um He's okay, he's alive and well. Well, he, he's okay. He's alive and annoying, I should say. So he's, he's good enough, he's getting on my nerves like he always is. Um, he was rushed to the hospital last night with symptoms of a stroke. Ran all the tests, he didn't have a stroke. He, my cousin who is a nurse and the doctors are saying that it seems like he had a TIA I can't remember what that stands for, but basically it's like all the symptoms of a stroke, but it doesn't actually like get to the brain. But he's having some balance issues and walking issues. So he's going to be here probably until at least throughout the weekend. This door don't work. Oh, it's closed. So how do I get in here? They lock the doors on me and go the other way. Anyways, um, yeah, so he'll probably be here throughout the weekend or at least until Monday because they're going to send him to a, to like a physical therapy rehab center um, just to help, you know, get his balance and walking back in line. So yeah, that's what's going on. So I'm about to go back in here. I got a little cot, a little recliner chair to sleep in where is the can I go in through here um yeah so all is well this is definitely not what I expected of vlogmas I was expecting to I was supposed to go to Orlando tomorrow nope I can't go through there where the heck is the emergency I was supposed to go to Orlando tomorrow and um, pin two of my lovely subscribers for graduating. Um, and then Friday, I was supposed to, I mean, and then Saturday, I was supposed to start a four day trip. But none of that is happening now because this is the priority. So, yeah, anyways, thank you for watching. Um, thank you for your prayers in advance because I know I got some praying subbies and I truly appreciate that. Like, I love y'all. Thank you so much. I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. I'll put my daddy on camera tomorrow if he's up for it. He will be. He's, he's a trooper. <laughs>